Hey guys, how's it going? It's David Eric. We're gonna check out this party game called Ultra Food Mess. Looks pretty silly. Look at this cartoon art, I guess. Just drawings. Um, it's a versus type of game. Um, you can have up to four players. There's Tom, Calabrenzio, Sandy, Barry, Saruman. <laughs> Let's choose uh, Tom as I burp. Um, now there's different modes. You can do catching up, organic, juice it up, wet the fork, nice to meet you, prepare to die, shot dog, king of the mill, exploding fruits, hot puddles, or chop chop, or you can just do all modes, which we'll do that. Now, uh, we can add some bots, let's add three, you know, like my channel has nothing but bots, right? So stay within the crown, touch the player at the crown to drop it, so king of the mill. So this is the first mode. All right, I'm on the top left. You can move these blocks around. And the characters kind of move funny because, like, your momentum. You know what I mean? Like, my momentum's moving me forward. It's almost like a slippery, like, uh. Like, weird, uh, type of momentum that adds a challenge to it. Like, your character runs, but in order to stop, you have to, like, move the, uh, the joystick a different direction. It's hard to explain. Prepare to die. Catch the pepper. Pepper's fire burn. All right, so we gotta catch the pepper. I like it. So you can play this with actually four people. It seems like it would be a fast-paced type of game. I grab the pepper. All right, so you gotta you gotta eliminate everybody. Come here. I got him. All right. So prepare to die means. You grab the pepper and you chase everybody. Yeah, so this would be much more fun without without uh with that with other people playing. Okay, organic disposal. Don't get caught by the saws. Avoid the obstacles that appear. They will push you. So you have to avoid the saw. So the saw is on the left. It's a big sausage. Big sausage pizza. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Whoa, 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 look at that. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Everything just went nuts. Everything just went nuts all of a sudden. So exploding fruits. You drop bombs from time to time. Explosions destroy other players. They create holes in the ground. Alright, so don't fall in the holes. Got that. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. All right, this is entertaining. I could get, I could get behind this. The, the idea, you know what? You could actually strategize and trap people like in a circle. Like, check this out. Oh, I won. I think I won all the rounds because it was best of three. All right, so we'll we'll go ahead and do another another series. Oh, look at this. Are these waffles? These are waffles. I do like the animation. I like the way the characters look. They have a little bit of quirkiness, a little bit of personality. Deep inside. Achievement. All right. So there's achievements. So I played one match and I get an achievement award. Kate. So new character unlocked. Nice. So it does seem like there's unlockables. Let's see how many achievements there are real quick. So what? 10, 14, 14 achievements. All right. Not too bad. Let's go back and uh, let's play as Kate the Tate. She had tart, and uh, we'll play all modes. I I love, you know what? That was that was really entertaining. Actually, that was a lot more entertaining than I thought. There was a variety. What the fork? Watch out for sharp knives and forks. So obviously, a game like this is much more better when you play. Uh oh, it's coming in. Bounce this guy. Could I just push him? There we go. There's one guy. I almost want to like try to shove these guys. Oh gosh. There we go. Ah, the strawberry dude won. All right, here we go. Chop, chop. Avoid the saws. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I 
you know, honestly, I could see myself like if, if I'm with a bunch of friends and we've been drinking, just kind of throwing down a few rounds of this. It's not, you know, I'm sure there's better party games out there, but this one does the job. <laughs> you know, it, the games are at least creative. They're zany. Um, animations are cute. There is some strategy. The way the characters move is is the most challenging part. Because, like, look at this. In order to change direction, you have to kind of, like, start moving the analog stick away. Oh, and I ran into the, to the saw right at the end. So pre prepare to die. Prepare to die was all right. This one's the next game. I would like to see another one. Oh, there's a big thing of milk. I love milk. Okay, here we go. Can't kill two of them? Nope. Let's grab it. Thought I was gonna be able to kill both of them. There we go. Got him. Shot dog. All right, what's shot dog? Aim at other players when they're on site. You shoot automatically. Okay. Oh wow. Okay. I can get behind. Oh wow. Everybody just died all at once. It was like a, a Mexican standoff. <laughs> all right. Nice to meet you. Swing your weapon. Destroy the other players. Okay. Nice to meet. Okay, this one. I guess your the 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 thing moves just based on your momentum. I couldn't swing it. Look, these guys are swinging their stuff around like nothing. Who's gonna win? I'm going. I'm going for the potato guy. I think he's gonna win. Let's go, potato. Up. Oh, see, I told you. Catching up in four. Okay, so it looks like we have almost a near tie. We have two, me and the other guy. Okay, so I don't think, I think this one you just avoid the catch up. Where am I at? Oh, there I am. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Stay away, catch up. No! Oh, okay, good. Uh-oh, here we go. See, that's fun. It, what makes it crazy is the fact that your characters kind of move like almost like with no traction. Oh gosh, that was a little tricky. He won. The bot won. I made number two. I wonder if I get a. I wonder if I get a new achievement. Look at the, the little poop underneath. Fourth place. Do I get? Oh, play ten rounds. Achievement unlocked. Let's see what we get. Ched. Little cheese guy. Okay, that's cute. <laughs> oh man, this is this is actually. Let's play as uh, the pizza guy. What was his name? Cala Calabrenzio. I like that. Okay, let's. I've done that. I haven't done juice. Let's, let's select juice. Hot puddles. Okay, so I believe I've played. I believe I played most of them. That's cool. That'd be cool if there was like unlockable, unlockable modes. So juice it up. I think this one you paint. Yeah. So this one's almost like Splatoon. You just basically paint as much of the ground as you can. See. So there's a there's a good variety. The games are not just all you know the same, redone over and over. There's there's a good amount of variety with what you get in the game. So definitely a lot of different modes that's not too bad i actually can can get behind that again there of course there's probably much better party games in the oh i want party games in the eShop. but hey variety is uh the spice of life right not every game has to be some big third party release this one does the job it's probably very affordable in the eShop. you can gather around four friends and play these games Pretty easy, you know, pick up and play. Just have some fun, right? Games growing up weren't all heavy hitters. <laughs> this one's not bad. This one's actually... I, I like the way the games are laid out and stuff like that. And again, it's pretty simple. Oh my gosh, I want the stupid... Give me the crown. There we go. Oh gosh, come on. The chicken leg. 
See, the characters are cute. I actually like the art. Pepper to die. Here we go. This one's probably my most favorite game. Not only because... Oh, is that big... Is that burrito or is that a, a, a wrap? I want some of that queso dip right there, though. Oh my gosh, I just got eliminated. I want some of that queso dip. Mmm. I'm craving some chilies, guys. Alright, who's gonna win? I'm saying turkey leg. Nope. <laughs> the ice cream cone won. Alright. Let's see. Who's. It's three way tie? Hot puddles. I haven't played hot puddles. Let's go. We gotta win. Oh, there's no reason why we're this far behind. Oh, gosh. So this one's almost like the exploding watermelon one. Except a different take. The, the, the stuff falls down randomly. I think I'm gonna win this one. There we go. I, see, I called it. Like, literally, the second I said, I think I'm gonna win this one. Uh, hot puddles again. So two in a row. Well, that's because I chose only, like, three or four events. So... That's why it repeated. I like that you can customize the playlist. You can choose all the modes, or you can choose only a handful or a couple. That's actually good. Oh, those guys just, like, literally committed suicide. They literally just walk into the puddles. <laughs> there we go. I think with that, I won the round. All right, guys. So not too bad. Uh, enjoyable. Let's see what I unlocked. I, I definitely need to play this with some friends so we can see what's going on. I didn't get an achievement, but yeah, Ultra Food Mess. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you on the next one. Have a great day. Peace out.